Hello, what's up my best ones? What's up? Welcome back to my channel. I am Boke here. First time you stop by, subscribe to this amazing video. Subscribe to this amazing channel. So guys, for today's video, loud and clear from the coastal region of Kenya with a new banger, guys. Stay tuned, watch the video to the end. Like, share and comment. Let me know what you think about it. And this is a winning tour right now. Oh my God. Kuna Serkar. Oh, yeah, guys. So um, I'm told like it's a, a police station or something like that. I don't, I don't want to to point over there. Yeah, guys. As I was telling you, it's an evening too. Around over here, I'm going to take you. This is what is happening at the evening time. Yeah, I'm accompanied by the my tour guide around. Yeah, I you know in my videos you just see him. Yeah, and in an African way, guys, we're using this rough road to the spot. We're heading direct to the other side of it. We're using different um, roads to see what is really happening. And uh, yeah, I like the view of the sun because it's kind of setting. And uh, you know what, guys? This everything about this place is just like uh, it's it's warm, it's hot, but the the trees and everything like uh, they're giving it the greenness. And also the trees that they grow over here, they are different from the trees that are, they are growing around where I'm coming from, like to the other, um, how we call them. Here is the coastal region. Well, I don't know where my region is now. <laughs> anyway, anyway, my good people, the view is viewing, huh? You're liking it? I'm telling you, it's just a kind of uh, best, best moment that I've ever had because it's been nice everything around enjoying around hanging around finding meeting new friends like oh my god it's been an amazing part of it in my life i in my life i'm talking about it yeah so we, we reached that day where is this road heading to bahari what bahari do bahari do bahari do bahari do uh. hey what is that a hotel uh. bahari oh this one hey in the hotel is hoteling i'm telling you where so these are the rooms or the hotel, I, I don't know. The, the Airbnb, yeah? Uh -huh. Yeah, sure. Because, uh, yeah, guys, okay. yeah, it's a hotel. Yeah, but this is a certain, like, a, I will call them Airbnbs, guys. So, we're already arriving at the certain place where we're going to have fun, enjoy, getting to know what is happening at the evening time, evening moment, evening time. We got a tall palm trees around. Yeah, the coconut trees, guys. Look at it. And this the view is viewing i'm telling you everything is like another level guys yo yo so let's keep moving imagine more yo The waves are so high, like it's very, like the waves are so high. So this is what normally happening at uh, evening hours over here. People sitting, enjoying, having fun, and uh, you can see they are watching some activities happening here with our kids around. Oh my God! Wow. <laughs> oh my god, I don't know what I
just at the street of Ukunda, yeah? Yeah, this is the place called Ukunda, guys, at the coastal region of Kenya. Yeah, we, we, we just, this is what is happening at night hours, evening hours. Apa ibi tozipa, ara sijuze nye wia nataka, trying to look for a, for the sleepers. Look at the beach. Oh, I don't know which one, which one is which. You can have to get like this, but for the big people. I don't know. The owner of the place, huh? Abari Ako. Kubwa ya hizo za hizo zikuwa hati, kama hizi kubwa. So keep moving up on the house. Wanna pick on a pool on a fanya money. The street life of over here it's just like a the village thing. Eh? They are selling a uh, different kind of bridges all around, all around. We keep moving. The town is so busy, very, very busy. and announce the Sasamadera, the African We are the street side guys. Yeah, this is the village. Th not not that village thing. Oh my god. I'm used to the village until I'm just shouting village in the town. <laughs> in the street area guys, yeah. So they are really they, they are, their business is just going like uh, it's busy. Like it's really really busy. People are just moving up down, up down. The street is busy. Still working at this other side. It's late. It's really really late over here. Yeah, so this other side, yeah? Yeah, we're moving to the deep uh, sides of which we want to see the street areas, everything about the areas. Everything. Yeah, so and this is the interior part of it, the village part. Yeah. Hope nothing bad is there because I fear. I fear. Yeah. <laughs> Security matters a lot, yeah? Wow, so there is security over here. Hope nothing will just happen because of my god people. I told this thing of Comera thing is just happening in the village places. But also over here once people just see you with the camera, they're like like you you're staring at you, they they just like they want to shout at you, they can't shout like you know. Yeah. <laughs> but we keep moving. So we're going deep inside the street areas. Hey stuck in the and I don't want to die inside here. So the village part of it, huh? Mm. Yeah. Let's see the village side of uh, 
What you call it again? Momanga village. Mo? Momanga. Momanga. Yeah. Ukunda Momanga village. Yeah. Okay. Ukunda Momanga village. I will not forget that. Yeah, the village, Mumanga village. Now I just want to see the to experience the village life of over here compared to the village life over there at my area, guys. Yeah, but over here they have palm trees. That's the different thing that you have here. The beautiful palm trees. They are long, they're tall, and everything. And I want to see also how they build their their houses and uh, their their mode of living. Actually, that is the main thing that I I want to know about this certain area yeah so the video was about the evening routine around uh, in an evening tour that's why you see it's evening yeah it's evening we started it uh, very early we were passing the street side we went until to the beach side yeah because the area that we were passing you have to pass to the beach side uh, from where I'm, how I'm staying to this other side oh my god I'm really enjoying the tour is touring hey I'm telling you guys, I'm loving everything about this area. I think I should find a place and uh, come and live with you over here. Because, eh, hey, hey. ah, but this life of sweating daily, <laughs> this life of sweating daily, oh my God, it's another level. So this is the area, okay? Yo guys, what do you think about this uh, village, guys? From the comment section, let me know what you think about the, the village. Is it a... Uh, a wonderful one look at there you know these things i normally see them at the tv when they are As acting you can see how they the the mode of dressing in the village over here yeah abaria come on salama yeah so you can see how <laughs> i was trying to take the the pig there to film her without her knowing sorry guys because you never know how the person will react that's the mode of dressing they are dressing they have to put the these uh what do you call it kanga. the kanga they call it kanga in kiswahili but we we call them wrappers in english so you put on the wrapper and on at the bottom and also at the top the kilemba we call it kilemba right? yeah. yeah the kilemba is the how you cover your your face your head with hey hey Wow, we have the moon. We call it Christ, Christ stall. Christ, Christ. <laughs> so, yeah, guys, this whole side over here, it's now starting getting dark, 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 and my car, uh, my, you can't even see me now. I'm now becoming dark, dark like uh, this, uh, the Giza. <laughs> Habari zenu washkadau. Ngoto ah. Na uzije samaki. Kuna? Kati kiti. Na na tuka kula. Ni how much? Kujo kule ba. Could you pull us a man? Guys, this is the village life of this place. Apo kuna itwaje? Uko kuna itwaje? Okay. Mumanga village. Iko ready. Iko ready to Nitam. Sinono kwambia nitam. Ndio uchukua moja ule. Wana ujia huko huko. Ah? Hadi jioni zinaisha huko. Mm. Ana supply. Au wanapeleka mjini? Mm. Najua ni ngumu kutoa. 
Here in the deep areas of the deep areas of the village thing. Yeah, the Anikos. Salam alaikum. Yeah, deep areas of this side, guys. Just I'm um, walking a random video tour to know how people live around here, guys. I'm going to show you the culture things about the living, the living style of these people from different uh, communities in the region of Kenya, guys. We have different. Um, we, it's one country, but we got different cultures, different communities with their own things, their own lifestyle. Yeah. So for us in our village, it's more different also. So for them, I want to learn new things from them, from them, yeah, because you have different things. Their mode of feeding, like um, the food that they eat, it's different from the food that we eat. Yeah, for us in our home, the local meal is ugali. For them here, the local meal is... Nisima tu, ni ugali tu. But nini mkona biryani, mkona nini, mahamri. Yeah, for them, they have, like, for us, we have rice. We call it wali. So the only thing for them, they have uh, pilau. Uh, biryani oh my god and many many more <laughs> it is, see. so I'm just deep inside this area you see guys and everything about their area is like a green 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 big trees and they have the mango trees like the mango trees are so many so big in this area I don't know how long Zina Zina, Zina grow for how long one month. for one month after every one month Zina produce no, huh. Oh, it's go, it's a seasonal thing, huh? yeah. So it goes with the season. Passing by, we met this mom over here. Wanna say hi to her? Abariako, mami. Salam alaikum. Muzima, buheri wa afya. Now, now, me buna pumzika. Peke ako tu mekaka. Mimi na ito boke. Na tembe uku niki mimi nimgeni uku lakini na na tembe tu niki salimiana. Now na ito. Gina. Gina. Yeah. When you're rainbow, mama, you're man. Not kaku kuju. Hmm. We don't need your kuku. Kuku takula. Yen utakula kuku by force by fire. Yeah, man. You put on the camera. Una me na kuta na me. Una me. Oh, yeah. Moda. You see, chapika. You see, kaja di mazi. Uh huh. It's a ibasa na ndau kakule. Uh huh. Viungo viungo ibi. Watu mi viungo vipi. Hmm. Viungo vipi, jamani. <laughs> She's so lovely, guys. Yeah, so we're not too to lie at Ah, Nashkoro. Yeah, we're not going to be able to do it. We're not going to be able to do it. We're not going to be able to do it. We're not going Mm-hmm. And we see that mosquitoes are so many here, even they got inside the net like 20 of them. Even if you want to get them, they are so there are so many. So guys, look at the beautiful. Mm -hmm. 
Sasa mimi napita pita humu mm. na naishi peke yako huko mami. Hamna mm. jukuu. Hapa jukuu hapo. Kwenye mama kibai ni wasoma shule. Oh, wako yeah. shule. Yeah. Umekula lunch? Yeah. Na ndio kunda mimi kunda kama saa tano na acha bado kidogo. Sasa na mama unajua sasa ngapi? Mm? Unajua sasa ngapi? Eh. Muda wa lunch ushafika. Sasa hii ni late. Ndeke wewe mboga na nini? Lazima ule cha ondoka. Sasa ni kusoma. Eh, kaki. Ana kaji siku ndani. Ni ndani? Ah, usisimame tu. Tuko sawa. Leo tunapita tu. Unasema leo leo unataka kula nini? Mimi. unajua kunengwa kiu no ndio <laughs> 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 she's so lovely she's so lovely i'm telling you it's only that you don't hear what she's saying but oh my god i was telling her to sing for me a certain song but she said that she's so old right now she cannot sing <laughs> Anyway, anyway, it is what it is, guys. So this is the random things that we're doing here in the village because such people are blessing. Such people are blessing from coming. You. When you meet such type of person and uh, she's so nice and amazing to you, just you have to appreciate and give something to her because they are so like uh, they are our mothers and everything, guys. I love everything about them. Okay. Imagine I saw I, I saw I just saw the I just saw the and the mango. I was like, can I go and pick the mango? They are say like that one is for the owner. They will bring problems. <laughs> I never know that even this other side they know they have that thing of this is mine this is mine this is mine but it's only one Kenya Kenya you know what is Kenya welcome Kenya you'll see what is Kenya guys so yeah the view of the place is just like this the trees that are so many over here the mango trees are they are big like big and also we have the palm the palm the coconut trees which one is what it is so this is a color. Oh! Look at these guys. That they made they, they they use they do colors. The color things. So in a pandwa? I mean a jimmy. 
Okay. For how long? Like no, it produce, no, it produce mm. um, flowers. Yeah. So even this one was over here for a long, like for a yeah. long period. Okay, guys, this is a tree that produces uh, colors. You see, it has colors inside. Look at it. Oh my God. Habariyako, <laughs> give me a ride. How are you? I'm okay. Let me ride the bicycle. Thank you. This side. It was so lovely. Oh my god. Hey, this is the village thing. Turn on the We keep moving. That is it, guys. Oh, the owner want to go. Nashkuru. Thank you so much. Wow, that was one part of it. Let's keep moving. Where? Hey, bye. Yeah, just uh, just relaxing under the big tree over here. Oh my god, the journey was so so, like oh my god. <laughs> I'm loving everything, guys. I'm just having a good uh, time with my new family over here. They are so nice. They are so lovely. Yeah. So this is your home. Hey, your home is good, nice, beautiful, and everything. Uh huh. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Wow, because the girl is beautiful. I'm loving her. Mm -hmm. So, we keep moving. Eh? So, guys, we're just going. The funny, the funny part of this place is just like uh, what we're planting at our home, the same, same thing that we, they're planting over here. But why, why do you plant cassavas at the same time with maize? Why? And also you give you have to put like 10 10 i don't know how many maize of <laughs> and yet guys this is funny look at it one two three four five six and you expect them to produce both of them yeah. no you have to put only one one maize at one hole 
and they produce big big maize guys uh, uh, no okay this is how you do it okay you you make the hole like one over here two three four five then you plant one 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 in case of this one will not uh, germinate uh, the, this one will germinate it will give a space on the, the next one to germinate like look do you know that uh, this one is now affecting this and this this one could be big yeah. right now could be big but because of this one and this one it's small because it takes the fertilizer think about it huh? it these are the cassavas yeah? yeah. only one one now the cassavas are giving them one spacing 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 but the maize you're giving them 20 20 20 do you do you do you apply it no whatever you add the the anything. fertilizer no any no, nothing. nothing then you are wasting your food no but this is good it's not good and you're just saying that it's good yeah. look there are so many you're wasting all these you know this one will not produce this one will not produce only this one will produce this is how we do it how we farm around yeah i should teach you how to farm now uh. <laughs> anyway guys this is it about it this is how they farm i was just having the job because i'm now seeing what they're doing over here they are uh, they're they're giving 20 20 maize in one hole <laughs> and they expect all the 20 20 maize to produce Oh my god, this is the farming part of it because guys, uh, they're also farming. They're also farming. The same same thing that we farm at our area. We put the, we plant the maize, we plant the cassavas. What else? The bananas. What is the bananas and uh, many more. Yeah. What is that? Oh, it's a tree. Yeah, it's a I thought it's a, a baobab tree, but it's fall down. No? Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. This is a mango tree growing now. Wow, wow. Imagine how big it will grow to reach the other uh, the other ones. Oh, oh you have the mangoes. Yeah. Okay. I'll I'll test to have one mango. I'll take a mango. To I'll test one mango from your your home. Yeah. yeah guys. So this is the other part of which we have also. Do you know that this is a these are uh, yeah. fruit uh, not fruit but bees. How do you call the peas? I don't know guys. Let's see. Oh, these are the peas. Do you do you normally harvest them? Yeah. You harvest them, you eat? Wow, wow, wow. With chapati. With chapati. Mandazi. <laughs> it's so nice. Biryani. Mahamri. So, 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 what about Toboshu? Mato? Matobosha. Hey! Hey, guys, it's amazing, guys. You see the big, big ones. Anyone with any any Mahamri around? <laughs> I'll be below or it's what? Oh, they harvested the maize. The maize. Now they want to to cause a bundika. Is it? Yeah. Or they, they are going to sell them like that. Is it in the pools or say? Like Ivo Ivo Mbichi Ivo. Mm. Mm. Is Shinga Pivi says? Ivo 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 it's big guys, look at it. They already harvesting. From these trees. Yeah. baba. When do we harvest? Mingi mingi ziko apiten. Ya kuonja. Daga kuonja. Ah, ndogo tu. Staki kubwa. Ona 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 hiyo yenye nyume kapo hivi. That no. This one ni kuna color hiyo eti. Kama hiyo unize nyongesha. Hii naka kuiva. Oh my god. Mtu anakula hivyo bila kuosha. Ah. Okay. Guys, let me wash this uh, and eat it. I want to test. Habari yako mami? Salama. Wazima pia tashukuru. Asante. Asante. Tuko huko hivi. Tunatembea tembea. Wow, these people are so lovely. Oh my god. Oh my god. Like everyone else you going to be like, "Welcome, welcome, welcome." Let me wash. They say that this one is, is ready, you can eat it. You can drink this water? Yeah. It's salty. Fresh. Fresh food. Yeah. I was so thirsty. Mm, 
Ni tam. Mm. Mm. I never knew this sweet. It's so sweet, guys. How they harvest this, guys. Mm. You see the color of it? It's giving it. Let me see how they are harvesting it. Ah ah! Come in, Akazi, Mambo. Salama. Guys. So this one is not enough. Is it empty? It's empty. Then we are going to put it in. Okay. Let's see, guys. Let's see. Okay, he's throwing. Hey! <laughs> it's amazing. It's amazing. Oh. Hmm. This is what they are harvesting, fresh from the farm. I just eat like um, like a, a monkey, but oh my god, oh my god, just I don't have otherwise. So guys, this is what is happening here in the village, and thank you so much, thank you, thank you so much for watching this video to this far end, guys. I appreciate because it's been a random tour and to see how the lifestyle of these other people and also their mode of living and everything guys i've come to realize that these people are farming the same way they are uh, they are so welcoming they are so, they, like they have that thing guys. they feel they feel they feel they feel it yeah so i have learned how they they farm it's different in a kind of we we, we plant same food no? but they plant in a different way like maize they plant 10 maize in one uh, hole and they have also different kinds of of things. Their main food over here is them is also the ugali, but they get pilau. They got uh, other meals and uh, these fruits over here. The mangoes being the local thing that is every 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 home got it. Every home got the mango thing. So guys, thank you so much. As I'm going back again, we will meet in the next one. I really appreciate for everything that you're showing unto me. Never take that for granted, guys. Feel much welcome. Always show me love and uh, be blessed. Bye bye guys, I love you from the bottom of my heart. Bye bye guys. Say bye bye. Wow. Bye bye. <laughs> and bye bye. <laughs> they are so nice guys. So guys, bye bye. We call them matoke. How do you call them? Over here. Daisy. Daisy. Mm. We call them matoke. Oh, let me eat the African.